hey guys what's up welcome to one more video in this channel so this is my first video in English so before at all I hope that you enjoy this video and sorry about my mistakes during the video because I'm still learning English so this video we're gonna talk about uh, how to handle errors in Flutter specifically how can you handle errors in your UI in Flutter. So to start, I created a new project, and in this project, I create a home page, a stateless widget that I, I call it home page. And in this page, I put a elevated button in sender, and I put a text that uh, that write uh, handle error. Okay. So, to start a uh, handle error, we can we can try uh, handle uh, a common exception. So we can create a exception, and I create the exception, and this object exception has a property called message so we can put uh, this property here so I will put uh, generic generic error okay so when I click in this button uh, this exception will be uh, triggered and and show to us in the bug console but for a while this exception uh, this don't show on our UI and I will click to to see okay so when I click in this button he throws a exception this exception for us and and in the bug console we can see that okay so how we can show this this error in our UI okay are you are you can put a try a try catch here and after this we can create a we can create a generic exception to show in our UI. So I, I will create a dialog. And this dialog has uh, two properties. is a context and is the build property that, uh, that have a, a function. Uh, that have a con build the context as well and we can return uh, alert dialog for example alert dialog okay and this alert dialog we can put actions and title and content I will put title first at all so I, I can put text and I, I will put oops oops and three dots and in the content I can put uh, the message that that uh, exception have so I can I can lead with this exception uh, use on exception and when this uh, when the error is a uh, exception he he drop here and we can get this exception with the this object that i call it e but i can put uh, whatever name that i that i want so I, I I will keep E, okay. 
So to, to get this exceptional message, we can put uh, e dot to string. And after this, he get uh, this generic key error message and show to us in alert dialog. Okay, so I will start here and tap again. So here we can we have uh, our exception. Okay, but I I I'm invert the properties and I put uh, the content in title and title in content. So I will fix this. Okay. So I will, I will do a start again and this is it. We can, we have a, our, our error handle in our UI and this is the most easy way to show the, the errors and in your eye with the show dialog, but you can show in a widget or a snack bar or in a toast and whatever. So how we can create our own type of error uh, to show in your UI. So I will create a error folder and create uh, errors.dart. So uh, now uh, I can create uh, my own error type uh, with a class. So to start, I, I create a class called Failure. And this class will be extend for, for uh, extends for ex exception. Okay, and here we got a uh, error because the exception is a uh, abstract class, and we can't extend our uh, abstract class. Uh, to fix this, I will replace extends for implements. Okay, so now we got a uh, failure uh, class that implements exception. And we can create uh, the property ha uh, as we want. So I create a message. So I create a final string message. Okay. And I can create a title as well. So string uh, title. And I put it here again, this dot title. Okay. And I, I will put this properties required because, uh, I don't want that, the, that his properties are new. Okay. So now I can create, uh, my own, my own failure here. I replace exception by my failure. Okay. And my failure uh, has two properties. So message and title. And we can keep this uh, handle here, but we can put another uh, handle with my my class that I that I created failure. So on failure catch e and I can show dialog again. So with this show dialog I can put e dot title and e dot message. Okay. So we have a hint here. Let me sh remove that code. So why uh, this hint show to us? Because failure uh, implements exception. So failure is uh, 
uh, of of a certain way uh, is an exception. So we can remove this here and keep our failure. Okay. So I will start and now we have a, a, our own exception with our own failure class and we create a, a own failures or exceptions that we that we want so i can create a class that uh, not implement exception so failure error example and this is the the same properties okay so now i can i can put failure error here and now I have a, I can have a, a new handle, so failure error, and I copy this and paste it here. Uh, let me see. Okay. Show dialogue error. That's it. I don't know. Uh, okay. Now it's correct. So I I will change this message error two and start and generic error two because uh, he handled my failure error, my class failure error that I created on here. And this way we can create our own failure, our own exceptions, and show in your UI uh, with this this uh, handle. We can use try catch. Okay. So for Rio, that's it. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry about my mistakes again. So see you guys. Bye.